Hello and welcome to Secret Agent Agency. Uh, it's it's me, the zeroth N in mayonnaise, Kevin, and joining me is the second N in mayonnaise, Chihun. Mayonnaise? Where did that come from? And here's Andrew, the fourth N in mayonnaise. Hey there. Can't wait to start uh, tipping developers. Oh god, you're right. <laughs> that was the topic. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like that Jihoon didn't have one and Andrew did. That's funny. This is something I, I thought of way before of ours. I forgot about it. That was a good one, too. Damn it. Maybe I'll get it ready by the second half of the stream or something. All right. So last time we left off before um, getting in the cart to go to Gold Saucer. I was like, well... Maybe uh, I'll be able to, like, explore this zone. So I decided to hold off on going to Gold Saucer. But you'll notice I still can't explore this zone. But not, f not for lack of trying. Can't get in through here. Can't get in through here. So we're just going to push the story. Yeah. The story must go on. Oh, so, um question we're still we don't we're still missing magnify right yeah i found a, a cute combo where um i don't know whichever spell gives you like break like petrify mm -hmm. having that connected to both synergy and then a second instance connected to magnify has constant petrification happen and it's like deletes random crash mobs not that it seems they're very hard at all in this game anyway. Yeah, and we are playing on what's effectively the, the hard difficulty, at least the one that's available to us currently. Because yeah. the, the remake tril trilogy, I assume, will, uh, uh, with the third one, kind of treats hard mode as like a new Let's game plus. So. Gold Saucer time. This will take us all the way to the salsa. Hey, you can't let those assholes talk to you like that. You should go back and beat them up or something. Practically, the whole damn town came out to crap on him. Someone tell me why I'm the only one who's pissed here. Hey. I told you. I can take it. <sighs> Think you could at least tell us what it was all about? They were talking like you sold them out for money, but... I know that isn't true. That's not you. So how'd they get it so wrong? Where the hell is it? This about her? About Marlene? much. Decent place with decent coal. Decent folks, too. Rough around the edges, but big hearts. Salt of the earth. And I sold them all down the river. Took away their future and their hope. Soot and porous dirt, but none of that mattered. We had friends and family, and that was enough. Till we learned about the miracle of Mako and all we'd been missing out on. And then we just had to have a taste. <laughs> so now only dine is opposed. Damn right I am. We can't just abandon the mines. Not after our fathers and grandfathers risked their lives to maintain them. I hear you, Don. I do. But nobody sees any future in coal. So I ask you, why break our backs working harder and harder when we're taking home less year after year? <sighs> if I may, sir. Once the reactor is complete, a portion of the revenue will go to the town. 
Your community will be preserved, or enriched, I should say. Listen, man. This is your chance to give your daughter a better life than what we have. You think I haven't thought about that? Come on. Are we gonna let some city slickers tell us our coal is worthless? We gonna let them tell us we're worthless? It would seem we've reached an impasse. In which case, any further discussion would be a waste of breath. So, Mr. Mayor, shall we put it to a vote? This is coming up now, by the way. Yeah. Oh, two years later. He doesn't explain it until later in the original, but this is an appropriate spot. <laughs> hmm. Everyone was ecstatic, convinced it was the dawn of a new era. Then one day. <clears throat> the reactor exploded. Y'all saw the aftermath. And then, Shinra came rolling into town. Burned everything. Innocent people in their homes. Was that Scarlet? It was, wasn't it? Yeah. Town. To craft a story that it was all the work of a local insurgent group. But ain't no villager ever gone near the reactor. They lie right through their teeth. Murderers. <laughs> that they are. Still, there's a whole lot of blood on my hands, too. for the reactor. I put us on the path that brought us here. Barrett. The saucer's waiting. How do you feel, uh, Andrew, about Barrett's characterization in this versus, um... The original. Because I feel like oh. he's the character that's probably changed the most. Oh, it's a lot better. I think it's better yeah. in general for every character because they just get Is a lot more really how it's opportunity be? to emote and yeah. kind of Listen, talk. I, I, guess, I can accept a better opinion. statement, but are you going far as say they're a complete different they character at this point, Kevin? And I can live with it. So... The feeling I always got from Barrett was he was kind of goofier with all like the cursing and stuff and uh, all, like the, the emotes were different, they were all like very high energy and also he came across as really violent so he was basically like a total loose cannon whereas Barrett in this game is it's it's there but it's subtler you know it's it's like you feel his anger but it's like contained you know it's like uh -huh. bubbling under the surface and that's just that's just something they weren't able to do in the original but it changes how his characterization <laughs> is i think glad to see we're all on the same page <laughs> I wonder how many mini games we'll have access to in a moment <laughs> From my memory, this isn't like the the major gold saucer trip. We're just visiting briefly, right? 
Yeah, there's like three parts to it over the course of the game. We'll only see two of them in the, this this game. And hello to you too. <laughs> this is incredible. Oh yeah, I learned something over the past week, uh, oh. reading about stuff in, in this game. Uh, so you know how we're like a splinter cell of Avalanche, which is like a much larger militia? Mm -hmm. uh, apparently the main branch of Avalanche is uh, like directly led and funded by Rufus Sh Shinra. What? Yeah. Yes. That's... Uh, that's dropped in, like, one of the mobile games. <laughs> it's it's not said here. It's not said in the OG. It's not in the movie. It's so what in does the mobile Rufus, game. So what does Rufus gain from doing that? Um, PR, basically. He can be, like, uh... So, we... We know some stuff. So, like, for example, he doesn't like how his, his dad ran things. Right. And I think he used Avalanche to bring uh, Shinra more into his vision as much as he could from the shadows. Oh, yeah. Barrett Wallace, Tifa Lockhart, and Cloud Strife. Look at them. Look! Waltzing around with the flower seller and Hojo's lab rat. Who are these people? At least they're finally on a real wanted list. It's about time. That's all well and good. But why am I in charge of handing out the posters? Don't they know I have a division to run? I think you're where the president wants you. Others are waiting. So this is the uh, helicopter that's been like flying around the overworld. Oh, it could it's be one in it. Them. One of them. I guess they're just like tourism helicopters. Oh, okay. Yeah. Buggy parking. All our scheduled flights are currently full. We apologize for the inconvenience. I feel like they let the uh, call start some mu music untouched, which is good. I know this thing. Future mode of transport. Where have I seen that before? Hmm, wink, wink, nice, nice. This is awesome. Yeah, and cool boy everywhere. Jeez. Are you there? Excuse us, I'm coming through. <sighs> oh my God! Hand holding, how loot. <laughs> Hey! Alright everyone, let's get this party started! Let's see how, let's see how they say his name.
Oh my god. <laughs> what is it with all of Yuffie's magical girl sequences? Right? I mean, they do love the... Remember, this game is made in Japan and Japan loves magical girls. <laughs> Ah, that would make sense. It's a dance battle. a challenge we must rise to meet it are you ready to rumble oh is this cloud are, are we gonna hear you yeah. This is the uh, 3D brawler or whatever, right? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I was only expecting that they introduced them like this. <laughs> Practice, eh? How prudent. Well, yeah. All right. Come on. Oh. oh, okay, it's left, left, right, right. <laughs> Is it basically punch out? Yeah. Um, it's, I mean, it's got left, right, and um, the dodges, it looks like, and I love it. Okay, so I have to... Yeah, they want you to uh, move. There we go. The timing is weird. I see. You know, feel for the towels. Well. 
Let's see if you have what it takes, young man. Ah. All right. Nossa, que chetão tá bom, mané. So it seems like only attacking consumes the ATD gauge. Only well, in the original game, the mini games were pretty shit. Oh. And, um, gold saucer. I will say this one is still pretty shit. Games were interesting. Uh, yeah, it's an improvement. Let's give our worthy contender. Another thunderous round of applause! I wonder how much of a poor POG. He says he's the director. Right. And he's the, the champ who oversees the battle sport. Well, I'm just wondering if Shinra were to abuse their authority, can he use the TO to follow the order or can he go against it? I don't see him filming it. I think that's what we're about to find out, isn't it? Yeah, we'll see how the story progresses from here. Well, thanks. <laughs> nice punching up there, Cloud. <clears throat> A small token of my thanks. One golden ticket. Gold card. Your ticket to paradise. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Yuffie's Wu Tai Pop Star outfit added. Let's go. <laughs> Thanks. Do we have a, any other alternative outfit? Okay, uh, this swimsuits. Oh, um, the uh, the Shinra Guard outfits they were in. Oh, uh, okay. And Yuffie has her Moogle outfit. Oh yeah. Interested. Hotel's gotta be that way. There will still be like a haunted Yes. Mm-hmm. Kinda wanna look around. And you got so excited with the hotel. <laughs> oh, it's so it's, fucking weird. It's fucking weird. Like most of the gold saucer is that way. Okay. They don't want me going fucking anywhere. What the hell is wrong? Yeah, this is so this entire sequence is like um 
was it? When I was reading up, it's not a soft like a soft point of their return. You're stuck here for a while. Oh, <laughs> lots of story. Live it up while you can. You just not promised to no one. This is such a weird vibe for a fucking hotel. This is what the planet's dying for. This is why we're bleeding our dry. Look at it. Look. Oh, oh, this this, this place does look hard. Siphon straight from the life stream. From our veins. <clears throat> Man, wait till Barrett hears about Bitcoin. over his head. So how about a reading to clear those somber skies? Whether it be dark or bright, I'll read your future right. Just let me go shoot the messenger, eh? This is some kind of toy. You do, lads. Eyes up here. <gasps> okay, Seth. Fortune teller extraordinaire. Put it there. <laughs> it's a toy, all right. Life like Come on, pal. Give us a smile. The gold saucer's meant to be a happy place filled with happy people, don't you know? So show us those pearly whites. Back off. You coming? Well, boys, it's Kate Sith. Yep. I mean, I figured that's how it would be pronounced. Was that people are arguing for some different pronunciation? Uh, in in Irish, it's catchy. Oh, okay. And he uh he speaks with like a Irish or Scottish accent, one of those. Hard to say yet. Sounds Scottish to me. Appears to be absent. So a friend told me this story before an evening, right around midnight. He hears a sound outside his room, so he gets up and goes over to the door. The spooky chairs. Wonder if there's anybody who plays uh, Queen's Blood here. And he's texting the get fit right in. And their deck is nothing but ghost type monster or something. But there's definitely gotta be some card game people in Golden Lawn. Wherever we are, Gold Saucers. Speaking of K, uh, K Sith and the accent thingy, 
So, you know, I have an accent, right? Hmm. No. <laughs> Great. Hello. Everyone has some degree of an accent. Yeah. But, so if you were to meet me for the first time and judging from the accent, can you, can you tell them from Korea right away? Or? Um, to me, your facial structure is Korean. I feel like right. that's, uh, that's but, high on the top. Right, but I'm talking about the accent alone. There's six of us all told. Well, five. And Probably one. not. I I hmm. wouldn't be able to tell. Hmm. No. Might I inquire as Just curious. What kind of pet? Uh, he was joking. Make it six. Very well. Now then. Hmm. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, gentlemen, but it appears we're all booked up for the night. Uh, I'm crying out loud. What about the other hotels? Forgive me, sir. But according to my records, all of our hotels are sadly fully booked. What? <laughs> Hello again. Nowhere to stay? And what's it to you? Now then, did you want one suite or two? Ah, you trying to scam us? I wouldn't need dream of such a thing. And to prove it, I'll foot the entire bill myself. Sure you will. Well, aren't we a prickly bunch? You there, dangly man. Would you mind checking one more time? Timely cancellation. <laughs> the Tonberry and Elagor suites have just become available. Shall I book them for you? <laughs> it feels so good to do good. All right, lads, enjoy your stay. <laughs> to the loo. Your suites are on the fourth floor. Please proceed to the elevator at the top of the stairs. I like Kate Seth already. I uh, do you like what they're doing with him thus far. He kind of just abruptly joins your party in the OG. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. There you are! The offer still stands. A fortune or two to steer you true. You can answer any question? Well, of course! Be it this, be it that, go on and ask the cat! <laughs> okay, we're looking for Sephiroth. Think you can find him? Oh, Sephiroth, you see. All right, hold on to your underpants! Meow, 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 meow. Things are looking up, so throw caution to the wind. Put I don't know why, but that chant reminds me of that, that cat food commercial. May pleasantly surprise yeah, you. Meow mix. <laughs> yeah. What's this got to do with Sephiroth? What indeed? Give me another chance. I'll get it this time. Come on. Watch your belongings. Lucky color. Black? That's important. That's a clue. We're done. Wait, don't go. Third time's a charm. Come on, you stupid thing. That's in the original too, by the way. Oh, okay. Yeah. Anything the matter? <laughs> Seek, and you are sure to find. But alas, you shall forever lose. What you cherish most? <laughs> the stars work in mysterious ways. That unfortunately is also a good fortune. <laughs> yeah, it's just what I cherish most. Uh... See what this crap does. My apologies, sir. Oh, 
odd. My readings are normally bang on. Don't worry, man, they are. The stars must be smiling on me. Odd. You know, like, personally, I appreciate how they, uh, this presentation of Google that he's writing. Yeah. Because, like, in the original, if you, you know, if you're not paying attention, you don't realize that thing is a robot, but what the thing is pulling here is, you know, it's a robot for sure. I really like the animations and the texture. Mm -hmm. Well, no, for sure, even more once we get into combat. I hear he plays very awkwardly. He is very interesting. I have some primers if, if we uh, struggle, I guess. Much like in the OG, I'm aware that he is extremely powerful if you if you get the hang of him. Fourth floor. It's like every character in this game. Very well. Yeah. They're all very strong. Goodness me! Oh, let me guess. We stole the Turks' rooms. Oh. <laughs> Elena. <laughs> Reservation under the name Palmer. Director of Space and Aeronautics. <laughs> yes, of course. Oh, one moment, please. <laughs> It says here you cancelled those rooms. What? No, we didn't. Uh, while we did have you booked for the Tonberry and Elagor suites, Mr. Palmer sent word that they were no longer required. That's impossible. Uh, is something wrong? We lost the rooms. What? Tell him who I am. I did. Well, no point dwelling on it. Now, where can a man get a drink around here? <laughs> you, waitress. We've arrived. I like in Palmer so far because he had like no we character in the OG. Yeah, I mean, like his he had like goofy animations and stuff, and all all the uh, the henchmen were kind of goofy. You know, but they've, they've been kind of serious up, but Palmer's still like, how's this guy even have a job? You know? Mm. And my guess is that he's just like a, a useful idiot, a puppet on strings. Well, space and aeronautics, you know, that may or may not be relevant. Oh, 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 right? Yeah. Space and aeronautics, I see where this is going. <laughs> so she, she not never oh, wait, wait. Oh, oh. Oh, is it a humidifier? That is awesome. I, I wish that I thing actually exists. I want that in my room, yeah. <sighs> Starting this Johnny's seaside flea trap. I'm gonna head out for a bit. Cool. But not for fun, just to take a walk. Hey. You've been acting pretty weird lately, Cloud. Rest up and shake it off. You hear me? Yeah. I hear you. <laughs> the Tumper thing, I think, is incredible. Mm -hmm. Why is the Square Enix store going to sell these, huh? <laughs> oh, we Death Stranding now. <laughs> Hey, 
<laughs> Cloud, come on, you gotta put it in there better, man. It's just so chaotic and funny. <laughs> Terrifying. Oh, is this... Is this where the Tomberry goes to recharge? <laughs> or he, he might recharge here. I'm guessing what he, is he that's his... Yeah. What is it, Roomba? Yeah. Remember who you met up on Rest while you can. <laughs> I like how you scared the second time. <laughs> uh, you know. <laughs> Object permanence is a bitch. <laughs> Sleepy times. Think we'll get a nightmare. Oh, I bet we'll get a Zach scene. More tired than I thought. Oh yeah. I feel like getting just like the worst nightmare of your life is just like a part of the experience for this hotel. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. Yeah, Zach. Zach moment. Sorry, man. Feel like I failed you. I can very slightly move the camera. So I guess. So if I remember correctly, Zax, Aerith, and Cloud aren't dead, but they're like unconscious or catatonic or something. Right. I yeah. Feared... Oh, okay. Should be in Elmira's house right now. Huh. Never seen material like this before. Something about the color. Didn't peg you as a bookworm. Hmm. Maybe, maybe Cloud himself. Oh. It's a nice uh, sewing machine. No, nice sewing machine works. Oh my god, the chair! Oh, we got all the data yes. links. <laughs> I am always looking for opportunities to do that shit, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're a menace. Okay, so that's uh, we're in Terrier World. Good to know. Would you care to join us? Definitely. I'm starved. I guess we we knew that already, though. You're supposed to say thank you. Yes, ma'am. No, you're supposed to say it now. Thank you. Damn, Marlene.
Hey, did someone come by the house last night? Oh, you must mean Biggs. He was just dropping off some food. Then what's with the sneaking around? You've seen those wanted posters all over town? Well, his face is on them. How do you know him? I'd rather let him explain. So long as Marlene's here, he'll come around again. He won't. Biggs isn't coming back. Tifa isn't coming back. Daddy isn't coming back. Nobody's coming back ever again. <laughs> <sighs> Sure they will. And I know just how to prove it to you. I'll go and get Biggs. Right now. <gasps> Need it? Always do. Honest and true. But... <laughs> Let me guess. You don't like dumb rhymes. <laughs> no, I like rhymes. Sometimes. <laughs> Not bad, kid. Not bad, kid. I feel like that was a pretty good dream, all things considered, Cloud. Mm. That could have gone a lot worse. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Charging up. Thought I'd come see how you were holding up. What? Nothing. Never mind. You're still under the weather, huh? No, I'm fine. Sleep helped. <laughs> so does that mean you'd be up for a little sightseeing with yours truly? Just so happens the Skywheel's running a special for couples. For couples? As in... I'll leave that up to your imagination. It's more fun that way. Okay. And this isn't the date, right? This nope. is just part of the, the normal stuff. Okay. Yep. Yeah, the date's later. Yeah, I was about to ask, like, you're trying to manipulate the dating, right? Yeah, it hasn't gone so well, but, you know. I was able to get Barrett in my playthrough. <laughs> that's that's honestly tough. Going it is very tough. To the lobby, sir. He maxes out at, like, um, 53 points. Barrett starts at 50 before you even start doing anything with her. Are you able to date Red 13? In the OG? No, only crazy. It's only the, the ladies and Barrett. Well, I think you can date Red 13 in this game. Yeah, I presume it's probably all the player characters. Yeah. Alright, but the game doesn't promote the uh, an loving animals. One of those ex-soldiers is an imposter. Among us. Among us. See you again soon. Oh, I ordered um, infinite wealth for thirty bucks. Oh, oh shit! It's already down to thirty bucks. Oh, uh, then I, got, I got a deal on the physical the PS5 the copy. Oh. Chad man. Yes. I understand the situation. 
Forgive me. Was it from Amazon or? Kind of. It's from Woot, which is having, I guess, their 20th anniversary, and they're like owned by Amazon. Oh yeah, Woot is like the like part of Amazon, but somehow they sell kind of cheap stuff. Yeah, I got um, Infinite Wealth and Cry Machina, which I heard is merely okay, but the art style intrigues me. Where have I heard that title? It's, um, it's a mecha game with sad anime girls. That only narrows it down a little bit. Yes, very, very little. <laughs> yeah, I'm aware of like a handful of games that fit that description. Yeah. But that's all I really know about it. Okay, fast Where travel. Would you like to go, Kubo? Hmm. Well, battles where is where the the plot happens. Okay, let's do fantasy world then. This, is that just a name for the station square then? This um music is wild. It's it's the era theme and the gold saucer theme just smashed together. But they have fun doing all the arrangements for this game, how many there are. Uh, ah, okay. What's your game plan here? Where are you going? Speed Square, let's go! Oh my god, I hate that so much. <laughs> oh, Materia! Steadfast block, yay. Good one. I think I have all the ones that I want. I beg your pardon? Gilgamesh. Gilgamesh. Ah, we have legally distinct Iron Man. Welcome, cadets, <laughs> to Space Ranger HQ. Our mission today is a vital one, and we will need your wholehearted support to defeat the enemy! Sir! It's like a mixture of uh, Iron Man and like a common Rider or something. I was about to say, like, Buzz, Buzz Lightyear. Prefer to keep my feet on the ground. Whenever I see something like Space Ranger, I think of Buzz Lightyear or something. Oh, we have to. Okay, now that. Okay, now I understand how the fast travel works. Oh god, a card. It's it's a lot of points. Space Ranger car. Oh, it doesn't say what it does. Man. Do we do we have to get this stuff now? Like, does That's it not on is the, it missable? Uh, uh, no, you you can always return to the gold saucer. Okay. 
universe is in your hands, Rangers. Many formidable fiends stand in our way, but we mustn't wait for God damn, I'm looking at the wood right now, and then Moon Factor, their special edition is 30 bucks. Dang, mm -hmm. I already got it when it was new, but still. Barrel roll. This looks very Star Fox. <laughs> No, no, dude, there's no fox in there. What, what you talking about? And it's nice little rail shooter. Oh, those are my friends. Okay. I like that apparently there's, there's no GP to just play the game. In the OG, like, uh, what you can get out of it is, like, a shit weapon for Aerith, mm -hmm. and then later a, a decent weapon for Sid, and that's kind of it. Just garbage items otherwise. Like the, uh, 1 in 30, 1 out of, oh, what is it? 135th scale soldier, or, um, trooper or whatever it's called. There's 1 out of 35. No. <laughs> I will admit that I was stupid enough to think that as a kid then. <laughs> oh, okay, so you get bonus points if you kill all of the ones in the group. Yeah. It's like uh, Galaga. And I'm not sure how many proton bombs we have, but I guess plus those out on tougher. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, okay. I thought it was like a screen clear. Damn. And we get... We have five heals. Oh, storage. I've been forgetting the barrel roll. I'm sorry, guys. No, we're not the frog. Uh, shit, I don't know who actually said it. To the barrel! To the barrel! Here with the, the rabbit's name was Pepper. I like how it described this as an Enkidu class warship, which is the uh, Gilgamesh's friend. Yep. Oh, it's a full heal. You learn this uh, mythology one way. You either read it or you play like, face stay nice or face stay serious. Once well, you get I the lock on, is it just how? Yeah, yeah. It's just if you get the uh, the I guess the big circle kind of close. Damn. Tight. Oh, so this should get the right for final fight. Don't shoot Iron Man. This feels a little bit like Railjack in Warframe. What about the uh, space area? Less oh, so. Oh, okay. That space ranger in the space is kind of jarring. I don't know why. It is. I agree. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, we'll see. Oh! I'm like smacking the wing. Okay. Ah. Oh. 
wonder if the Space Ranger is reference to this guy. Well I have no idea. No, hold on, let me try to get the pictures. Too. I've never heard of this. So I have a good idea. Our viewer, Chi Hoon, has um, shown us a uh, Wikipedia article for Space Sheriff Gavin. Gavon. Yeah, something like that. Japanese uh, your feet off the ground, mister. show. Oh, we got the rank too. Oh, we got 100 DP. Uh, That's a really good picture too. I kind of want to do this again. That's an accessory. Let me see what that is. Space Ranger Service Ranger. I got really close. I kind of want to just try again. I'm going to do it regardless of what you say. Ooh, okay. It's a... It's, it's, at, least, at least this stage of the game. Let's do this. Okay. You also get like an inventory bonus. I'm sure... I'm curious how much... Like, each bomb and all that is good. How they reach in. Inventory bonus wasn't that high. I think just yeah, getting all the squad kills I think will get you enough overall. Damn it! This is infinitely better than what was in the original game. Yes. Like the only reason I was able to get the weapons, uh, so I've been playing it again on the Switch, wow. and that's that's why I've been playing FF7 on, and it's equivalent like to the PS4 release, it's the most modern release of the game. So mm -hmm. I've I've also played uh, FF7 OG on the Switch, and for me that was a game that kept crashing on me or had like uh, glitchy graphics, especially after I woke it up from sleep. It's only crashed on me once, but yeah, it's like from leaving it on sleep mode too long. But in the um, the speed square on that version, there's like a specific spot that if you shoot on like a propeller wheel on this one thing, you get 25,000 points. <laughs> you only need 5,000 to get the rewards. That is not an original game, so I presume that's like a little cheaty thing they added. But I appreciate it. I'm excited to have like the Chocobo Racing works in this game. I wonder the developer team had a kind of pressure to like not to screw this up. <laughs> I'm sure this is very like a passion project for a lot of people working yeah. like, on it. Yeah, to me at least, this this could have come out of a boardroom. Like this was like a a lot of love went into this. Like I realized, Jihoon, that from how old the original game is, the people now in the studio, outside of like veterans, are people that were you know may yeah. or may not have originally been fans. I'm sure they wanted to do it justice. You keep just barely getting the squad kills.
I think we're aiming for 35,000. <laughs> Based on what the evaluation was last time, I think every restorative charge you end with is a thousand points. Oh, that's what it looked like. We'll see. What I'm saying is we can just spam bombs as long as we have the charges. I did on. worse. Damn it. Yeah, it is. So look, we can get an extra five thousand points if we don't use a single healing. You want to know what the accessory does? Sure. Uh, plus five percent to both um, attack and magic. So on an all-rounder, it's good. I'll come back in my own time, maybe. <laughs> All right. I feel to afford that card now. It's like 150. I think we got that, right? Or no? I don't know if you get the uh, the bonus more than once. The fate of the universe Let's find out. Well, the GP should also be shared between each zone. Oh, damn. Okay. Yeah, we got the card. We got this. <laughs> what do those even do? They're collector items. Mm-hmm. Gotta collect them all. Oh, we can see what every place has. How fun! Right. I mean, Wonder Square. That's where all the the large quantity of mini games exist for Gold Saucer. God, this music throws me off. I know what you're saying, but I, I turned that audio up to hear it. This is cursed. Presumably it means like later sequences it might have a different range and you're just with Aerith right now. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. I guess Wonder Square is Wonderment now. Mm -hmm. What? The Wonder Man Square. Go when you guys are um, at airports mm -hmm. and they have these uh, these like walkways, right? The automatic, yeah, like escalator style. Do you guys walk on them or do you stand still? I sprint. Yeah. yeah it depends on the situation, but yeah, if I'm on, I need to be. There as soon as possible, I rock or you know, fall yeah, fast. Yeah, I, I always power walk and you know. Oh, there's your favorite mini game from the last game. Queen's Blood! I spy something a certain all action mercenary might like. Wanna try? But it's for kids. That's what all the old bogeys say. Whatever. Let's see how it stacks up against the real thing. Oh, baby, oh, baby. Remember how to G bike? Sure, oh, we got maybe talk to these guys. Got your deck in order? If so, then it's time to throw down. Ooh. This is gonna be like the ones in uh, Kosovo. So. Uh, they're the uh, the puzzle ones.
Do you want to do this then? Or yeah, or fuck it. Go? Oh, wait. Fucking, uh, whatever, let's go. Yeah! Oh, do they wow. also get Gigantars? Yeah, it looks like they do. Alright. Um... I feel like this is the right play, and then I can push with another Gigantar. Hmm. I feel like I can do better if I push ahead a little bit. Um. Okay. Yep. Whoa! Interesting. Huh, that is very advanced move. Alright, got it back. But at what cost? <laughs> Oof. This may be your last move. Hmm. Might want to keep them if I can just get the three really quickly. We've seen that, like, effects st uh, continue to happen, even mm -hmm. after Curse Blade. What are you thinking? I want to make the center one a three so I can um, put the magic pot in the center. That's not good. Okay.
It's gonna be an uphill battle to overcome this now. I'm just gonna not have a strategy and play cards like a maniac, I guess. That's weird. Oh. Uh. Not Shiva time yet, but soon. All right, it's gotta be now. Let's do this. Oh, it's only on allied ones. Yep. All right, I think we have to build a special deck for this. Because uh, we want something that's more heavier in three drops. We got quite a few to choose from. See what happens. Want some twos as well. It's like just keep giving you cat or something. Uh, you get two of them. Mandragoras. There's another one that did that, right? Mandragora thing where it adds copies of it. Toggle details. That's right. Lots of no ability vanilla creatures. Yeah. Need that, um. Oh. I forget the name of that enchantment, it is plus two plus two to all creatures with no no move abilities. Uh Moragonda Petroglyphs? Why do yes. I know this? Fuck my grizzly bear is nice and strong. Yeah, why do you know that? Maybe like time sparrow lock. I do. All right, let, let's go. We have a we have the maximum Timmy deck here. Uh, I don't want yeah. these ones. Yes. So 
So you just gonna drop those two down and just shit out all your free drops. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh my god. I think specific build is right, and this ain't it. Oh, just lots of spot, like, uh... Make lots like, of... They got... They have cards that, like, over extend out. I don't know. We, I, we might need more like that. Like, like, diagonal. I'm gonna try so this one can, more time. Because then we can turn some on their edges. I don't know. Space Ranger. Another diagonal. So I got I got this guy who does that. Um, that might be the play. I mean, you can. Oh, I can also do this, which will give me one of these. What do you think? Definitely need to keep turning more our side. I think turning the bottom stronger. Ranger. All right, if we turn that bottom one, I think we've, we've kind of locked it. We just need to get enough points. I mean the middle. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, destruction. Sea Devil is one where you want to play it early. Yeah. We just need to take the top when we win. Oh, win more mode.
You've not to lose but our chains, Koopo. Forty points. We bro uh broken three digits yet. No no, I think forty's my record actually. <laughs> Succulent Sucker. Okay, we start with the Cactrot and enhances allies already in play as well as other cards in my hand. Alright, so buffing strategy. Oh, we're getting Gold Saucer points doing this too. Mm hmm. I'm gonna use my normal deck and see what happens. Okay. Seems nuts. You think I start with it? I mean, that's probably what the AI is going to do. Oh no. Okay. flip these doesn't look like it oh it doesn't do oh, any it, it double it's buffs it double buffs <laughs> okay I kind of want to do it <laughs> let's see what happens a little scary What do you think? I make a deck for this, probably. So I think just kind of you want to play around the fact that you want to leave like um, a spot open for it, or you can at least get two of your cards buffed. So, so we want to do we want to just go for them. like a lot of coverage? Yeah, if you can get a lot of coverage and kind of like zigzag around, you can drop them and hit multiple cards with plus threes, right? Yeah, I guess so. Like, thus far, these puzzle things have seemed to be encouraging you to try different ways of playing. Where it's like, oh, you can do this. So, like, low-power cards that just let you take over the whole board will work well if you can zigzag and then drop the buffs. I guess lots of ones and twos, maybe like one or two, uh, like two threes, maybe. Do you think I want to get uh, cards like um, Chocomug, where it? Well, that that one doesn't hurt, but is it like too gimmicky if I go for ones I get bonuses for enhanced cards? I mean, that's just synergies. That's what yeah. this game's all about.
What does this mean in gameplay terms, huh? He's a big, tough, strong guy. Actually, this Space Ranger could be good here. I don't know if there's a recent update or it's been going like for a while, but I guess Discord updated their. Yeah, they're gonna show ads. No, the turn off microphone button. Now, when I hover, hover my ho a mouse over, it kind of animates. So. And yes, there's the advertisement shit. <laughs> yeah. What advertisements? I don't know how they're gonna implement it, but there has been talk about how Discord is gonna implement the uh, ad. I've already gotten one for Lost Ark. It just kind of shows at the bottom of uh, your like server list. Huh. Oh. Oh, where did I see? Okay. Damn, I just... The whole advertisement and everything is just crazy, though. Like, how much money do they get? And then how much... One, how much money do companies spend on advertisement? And two, and how much do those... Well, I guess if, if they're... Question A can answer, I guess. Question B, automatically gets the answer, but... And three is uh, how effective are these ads? Sometimes if you... When you when these company blast ads to our face, we kind of get annoyed and we don't want to deal with them anymore. Right? I love being advertised to. <laughs> when, Just, you know, I felt the conviction in that. I believe you. Feed me all ads. Just shove it down your door now. Drink verification that's, can, that's motherfucker. That's what I want my life to be. <laughs> I don't know how... So there was this thing back when North Carolina... I don't know if I mentioned this before, but... Um, um, I saw this... Oh yeah, we did talk about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but basically, some company was willing to pay drivers. We put uh, put out like those uh, advertisement on the cars, <laughs> and I thought like it kind of makes I thought it'd be uh, make sense for me because like since you know I was I had a 1999 Toyota Corolla and it's you know it's it's not really it's a great car but it's not pretty looking so I always put a, there's a sticker on it and get some money for it too you know. Well, by the time I tried to find the company and contact them, I think they were shut down for some reason. We and uh, yeah, we did talk about this before. Sorry, I'm in the tank a little bit. <laughs> yep. I see you succeeded this children's card game. <laughs> it's 
So it's like how Kirill from Yakuza joins the video uh, kiss game and get more ex intense about it. I love how intense he gets about um uh like the the slot car thing. Yes. Yes. I get I get some back for that. <laughs> All right, so he just locked himself out. Yeah, drop uh, something in that middle and then just throw in all your buffs, I guess. And you already win, actually. So I guess not enough. Not enough. Gotta win more. Sure showed him. There we go. <laughs> That's a pretty decisive new record. Fifty upon. Are we gonna get a Chadman card after this? It looks like it. You and your opponent's starting positions are swapped. The cards with left facing attacks will finally get a chance to hit the enemy as they sit. Oh man! Okay. Well, this is definitely something we'll have to build around. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna keep that. I saw gonna... we have a few cards that can do that pretty well. Mm hmm. I guess I'm down to just playing cards that like don't uh, get any worse, <laughs> better or worse. Uh, let's get some soldiers, some some cribs, some uh, spear hawks, and uh, one finisher, probably fat chocobo. It should work well. So it kind of goes everywhere. Yeah. I'm gonna toss on my twos. Okay. Hey Kevin. Hey Jihun. Do you still have a DK account? I do. I didn't delete it. Uh, I heard that there's uh, like a some major event. Oh, uh, next week is their 
1.5 anniversary. Oh, okay. So they might give you some free stuff. I I heard that there's a lot of free stuff. They, they've announced what it is. Or at least some of what it is. Yeah, some of them will be just a... Do you still play free... actively? I stopped. Yeah. Uh, I log in, da log in daily to get those dailies. I've been playing um, Atelier Resli Res Resiliana and uh, Honkai Star Rail as like my, my main games, but... The Atelier one didn't get a shit on for like their gacha rate is kind of too ridiculous. It, it's it's kind of low, but I'm it's fine. Okay, I I've seen worse. <laughs> I, I'm a seasoned vet at this stuff. I've seen worse. Oh <laughs> man! Wow. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, double rider is huge in this. Oh, that's right over now. I want to get that Devil Rider out early, if we can. Yeah. How many of those do we have in the deck? Just the two. one? Two. Oh, we got two? Okay. Didn't oh. get one this time. Two. Uh... Crawler! Yeah! Liking that. Yeah. <laughs> so I take over the top and then try to get that one more in the center. tied right now. The <laughs> making you like play from the right but then your spurs to the left had me confused for a second. This is really confusing. Now you mention it. I mean, you're still looking to the left. It's just you're just playing from the right. I feel uncomfortable. Can I not do the other ones yet? Oh, they're rank five. Um. Can't say I've ever played this Queen's Blood thing. Is there a shot? Give me a shot. Pretty balls. Wanna wanna turn in my tokens. Seems you can do that from any zone though. Oh, you don't want to play any other mini games? Oh, well, I do. Hang on. Got a big pile of points to trade me? Like her Harley Queen voice, Harley Quinn voice, whatever. Saucer Squad. 
<laughs> oh damn, the safe crystal. Check of a jockey. This card is a good card, isn't it? Uh, I don't know. Oh, there's a fucking quest marker on the G-Bike. Hang on. Oh, wait. Okay, they're individual fights. Oh no! Definitely seems like when we come back to Gold Saucer later in the game, all these games are gonna have more modes. There's like definitely more room for more fighters in this. He's got two different attacks. I either have to press right or up. Damn. That was sloppy. Okay, so that's. All right. Fuck. I'm just not getting it. Hold on. By the time Wait, I get it, I game better. Another thing this week was um, a posting for in Japanese only for the moment, but um, an old Persona 3 like mobile game is getting ported. Oh yeah. Okay. Persona 3: The First Mission. Three first mission. I guess. Yeah, I've never heard of that. One of many extinct phone games. He's been, um, brought back Oh, was like... that for the, uh... I mean, considering when the Persona 3 came out, was it for, like, those flip phones? Oh, for sure. At that time. 
I don't think it's something you want to play. Now you can see the pictures for it. I mm -hmm. posted it in the display. get released around the same time as the um, the extra DLC for Persona 3 Reload. Almost, dude. There's like no scoring in this, it's just, you know, when that's all. Yeah, I, I don't love this mini game. <laughs> There's like lots of dodging until you can get um, like a guarantee to hit in. I mean, at least there's no, like, time limit, so you don't have to rush it. Yeah. I oh, know, it's it's basically turn-based. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it's basically turn-based, uh, and you have to... Like, you react based on the tells you get from the computer. I mean, which is... Uh, just like the punch elms. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, so oh, we here... got an accessory. So it's the same thing, but he does three hit combos. Okay, let's see what that looks like. Uh, I just love the idea how um, they're making this polygon model. Wow. <laughs> Also, I mean, this is my personal take on it, but I wish this part alone is a lesson for some of the developers out there. Like, you don't have to, you don't have to have as many polygons as you can to make a good game. This one is a light, looks good like this. Um, so, the some story that for my uh, college days was a one, like when we were. You know, I took some video game classes when I was really sure what I was doing. When I wasn't sure what I want to do in my career, and then of course, those classes they they want you to make the. That was way easier than the Moogle. <laughs> yeah. Oh really? This tells for a lot easier. Mm -hmm. That and he was never uppercutted. Oh. He only did it twice. And right, let's see what you get on the. Change kiosk. Here's what those um, silver problems ones do. So I have a question. Where's mm -hmm. where's the arcade machine where we get the Moogle late? It'll be someplace else. Or it's kind of wrapped into your Moogle playtime. No, here's your fee. Uh -huh. I knew you'd come crawling out of your room eventually. I mean, seriously. Who could resist the siren song of the saucer? You alone? Yeah. Got a little sidetracked and wound up losing the others. You know, you could tag along with us. And be a third wheel? No thanks. I know when I'm not wanted. Need to chill for a sec anyway. Bow wow wow. Bow oh. I hear the bow wow wows. Yeah, I hear it too. Just yeah. stamps a little corner, I guess. Take your points in right here with me. Oh, 
heard good things about the Chocobo Jockey from somewhere, so. <laughs> that concierge at the uh, hotel, Hunter Hotel, you know, that guy, that guy deserves a raise. It's not easy doing that upside down. Have you gotten the level boost material yet? Uh, the ATV, whatever. Uh, one of the rewards there, level boost. It, um, you don't have to master the material it pairs and it just gives you um, an, a, the next level. Oh. Uh. Alright, let's do a bike. This is gonna be fucking terrible. Okay, I have to get 30,000 fucking points. 30,000 fucking points. Don't forget to hold back when you're trying to break. Ooh, I like that. Little plus they had rolled up on getting on the VR call. Halfway there is the halfway point. Yeah. Is it missing one? Yeah. Didn't get more points for this actually defeated. But apparently I had to do better. Oh wait, oh wait, I did it. Yeah, you're the 30 fucking thousand. Mm -hmm. Alright. First try, baby. Now to never touch it again. Yep. Where's the trophy notification? He has to get never touch it again. <laughs> Ooh, whistleman's garbage. Is that haste? Auto haste? It gives you more ATP gauge at the start of a fight. Oh, okay. 
That's the kind of stuff that's really good on Aerith. Because mm. she has such a hard time building ACB. Oh. Alright, so we have all the cards for now. Uh, what book do I want? Eh, Cloud. That trigger was square. We've arrived at your destination. I'm a fan of Ghost Square. It's nice and quiet, not nearly as powerful. A guide move will ought to be able to show us around. I don't understand. The one music is like just throwing you out off that. No, party. like I I wanted to go to the um where the show is. So I tell I fast travel to it and it's not there. Just like real Vegas, baby. So what did Aerith want to do to, to begin with? The uh, Ferris wheel. I know in the OG Battle Square was um a progressive with Paul. You having an okay time getting around? No. Yeah, I figured. Okay, what's up? What's up here? All right, let's do it. It's got a little time. I just want to try this. Attention guests! We're not admitting anyone else at this time. Please come back later. Oh, well. Just means more time for us to explore the park. I just wanted to ride the sky wheel. Oh. Okay. That's Carol for now. Hey, that's what you go on the date. Um, yeah. It's original. So, how the fuck do I get to Chocobo Square? Well, look at the map, I don't know. I mean, this is the camera we're talking about. The, there's a the whole map on. This is the camera we're talking about. Here. He's not really versed in finding location on the maps. So. Well, I'll, I'll admit the map's not the most helpful here. We can't teleport until we've gotten to places. Yeah. Uh, everything is on the other hand. So you want to go all the way down to the bottom and go up the other way. Okay. I didn't realize there were like two platforms. Chocobo! Now, I presume there's not going to be any breeding in this game. And like, we've just been unlocking Chocobos in each zone, right? More or less. Seems like it. Yeah. I wonder what they, how they play as in the, in the races. Maybe that's a that's a game three thing. That's kind of what it was for me. I did all that towards the end. Come on, put yeah, you really couldn't do it until the um, the third part of the mm. Gold Saucer. This is some kind of race today, folks. In all my years in the booth, only seen a couple this close. So, Cloud, which bird do you think is gonna take home the win? 
Well, Aerith, considering their plumage and breeding, I think the choice is clear. <laughs> Welcome to Tokyo Square, Koopa. The racing birds here are as bright as lightning. I like that Cloud actually played along. Tifa! Oh, you're up. Feeling any better? Yeah, you were right. Just needed some sleep. That's good. I am a little surprised to see you, though. Must have been some nap. Uh. Taking a break from the fun? Pretty much. I could feel a headache coming on, so... You okay? Oh, yeah. This place does seem like it would give you a headache. I'm just not used to all these lights and sounds, is all. But I'll head to the hotel soon. Don't worry. Seeing all these chocobos kind of makes me miss Pico. Wonder how he's doing. Just watching. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. Didn't even break a sweat. It was stuck to you for a good while there. I'm just shaking my head. <laughs> Be careful there's also an asshole physics that was like that was like knocking all the other NPCs out of too. Madam M! Well, honestly, darling, if you wanted to spend time with me, you only had to ask. What are you doing in this place? Why, celebrating, of course. <laughs> My little jaunt to Costa del Sol proved fruitful. And now I'm flushing all that gill down the toilet. I swear, every time one of Sam's chocobos takes first. Probably doping his birds, the con artist. <sighs> Enough about me, though. What about you? Surely you've got better things to do than listen to me vent. Like paying attention to your girlfriend. <laughs> Go have fun before she gets bored with you. Whatever. Maybe I should expand, too. Open a parlor here at the saucer. Yeah! I'm a huge fan of John. You gotta win. Uh. Just watching. Check out the beat. Work? Got called saucer points? Oh, finally, somebody said work. Thanks! And have a wonderful time. Welcome to the Chocobo Racetrack. Do you currently have a membership with us, sir? No. Oh, I'm so sorry. But I'm afraid our services are for members only. Oh, man. All of our guests are more than welcome to watch the races on the monitors, however. You'll find so this will be after the, the plot, then. Mm -hmm. we, we still had to check the box, though. Yep. Alright, so I'll just head back. Oh. Durr. We got an event and battle left. Blocking. Okay. So my favorite message really than um, Dark Souls one or two. I got really into um, saying in Elden Ring, praise the legs after any like scripted long falls. Well, that's like leaving the message blocking on top of um, an activation. Part. Yeah. Like there was the um or point nest in Dark Souls 2, I think? After the first pursuer fight. I put this blocking. You can't see that my message is there, so where you're trying to activate, you just keep getting blocking popping up on your screen. <laughs> <laughs> it's so fucked up. Where's the event? Is that the top? There we go. There oh, we there go. Uh, that's where the play is in the original. Yeah. Yeah, the other one I like to leave in Elden Ring is, uh, Rain Butt Dung. Uh, which is great in the sewers. My favorite one that actually had me bust out laughing was when I made it to, um, Crumbling from Azul, whatever it's called. And um, right when you turn the screen and it's like a swirling vortex, the message just said, um, 
looks overcast or something like that. <laughs> 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 I shall be eager to wait our next interaction. <laughs> also, people going for evening. <laughs> For evening? It's kind of the message that only like American wow. players posted, I presume. Beautiful. Uh -huh. For morning? Hmm? Jesse. Do you know her? They never oh, met. I do. I never realized they never met. That's Jesse. She oh. Died I guess so. Edge. She was an actress? Yeah. She was a good friend. Not that I deserve one. Just a friend? Or a girlfriend? Eric. <laughs> you can be pretty dense when it comes to that kind of stuff. She gave as good as she got. Never cut me any slack. And yeah, just a friend. Sure was that black and white? I don't follow. You, young man, still have a lot to learn, right? So, in this world, Jesse and Biggs are dead, but Wedge is alive. In the other world we've seen, Biggs is alive and Wedge and Jesse are dead. So certainly there is one to complete the three. Right? And to be fair, on cloud, woman could, you know, woman could say, "Hey, come to my place, Netflix and chill," but you still gotta make sure. Well, shall we? Yeah. Gotta make sure message is clear. So where to next? The race is made. I don't know if Wedge actually made it or not. Guess they're done. I think he got day. thrown out a window by whispers. The end of the last game. Oh right. That'd be sad stage. if he if he like made it just yeah. to beef it later. Would have been fun to see. Well if he's alive, hopefully we bump into him. Alright, so I guess we'll see Red 13 at the battle square. Oh! Cheerio? Oh, it's a already upgraded HP up. So that like the number of ticks. That's like level three yeah. then. Yeah. That's neat. We think they were all at like level zero. Is a level three gonna be the highest? Uh, it should be no, a I think it, I think it goes up to five. Oh okay. Yeah, it should be gonna take you to fifty percent at max. I'm just gonna go by foot. The fast travel bewilders me. Battle time. After this, you can just teleport everywhere. Hello. So, I have two marks left on my map. One is Battle Square. I don't know what the other one is. Let me see whatever's this way. Is it, like, back to the inn? Could be, who knows. Up. More up. Do you prefer to just jump into a, a hole? Yeah, I do. We got a water park um, tube slide everywhere. Okay, so it's to the Skywheel Square again. Please come back later. Maybe it okay. opens after Battle Square. Uh, after the Battle Square, yeah. Okay. I just I didn't realize the marker never went away. Yeah, I haven't I haven't even been looking at your mini map.
Like, just any map set is very helpful. So I think we'll do whatever's at the battle square, and uh, then probably call it for the first recording. We're, we're over time as it is. Okay. Yeah, and then come back and do part two. Let's go ahead and do whatever's at the battle. Fight to the death. Musclehead Coliseum. Oh. Oh, this is the theme music. It's weird that they characterize him as a dog because he's so cat-like to me. In terms of his, his look, his personality and stuff, he's more like a lion to me. Yeah, his behavior just screams cat all the time to me. Interested in joining the fray? The Zoomies! I can only be clad in Aerith. Okay. So hoping I could just like slam jam this with Yuffie, but this will work. For that new accessory you got. <laughs> so you need good AoE. I just wish I could. Yeah. I know Aerith has that. Free challenge. Let's go. Everything. Let's 
More death. Going in. Going all out. Look in here. Oh, I think that's just kind of the <laughs> Maybe try to re equip. Oh, fuck that. I'm not sure how we get this, whatever. We'll say it is annoying both in this the previous game and still in this game, it seems. That, uh, you could at least have like a button there was like, you know, it could take you back to your pause menu so you can adjust before retry. You have to like exit out entirely to re trigger any of your shit. Do you have the elemental material in this game now? No. This ends here. Don't forget there's a second fight after this. Please be one big enemy or something. Okay, I can do this. I didn't mean to do that. is going to cure Aerith. Aerith is going to Radiant Ward. Someone looks kind of 
that pedal I, I had that uh screen ready <laughs> but oh, damn it. It, it might not even work oh yeah Ooh, yeah I don't... Ninja. yeah i don't know what's going on there it's wasting your points that's another two rounder So what? Wait, what is your current? Ah, oh, thirty. Okay, I'm wondering <clears throat> what your current level is. The thing is asking for you to get twenty eighty at least or something. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Yeah. What? Oh. I think the pattern is like first round is the second round. Well, like those are just honestly decided to play the whole thing. Do you like the sponge effect? Some yeah. Of those How is this a desperado? That's the guy you uh, want to take the palm up of your wrist. Yeah. <clears throat> so it's my turn? Okay. Ah! <laughs> I mean, I can see Bandit being the <clears throat> the quote unquote desperado, but why? Do you sound? One more Even though they do well. Get caught. Oh no, okay, he's in there. Ah, you absorbed the second time. Oh shit, <laughs> we're getting to be a high level here. Oh uh, wow. So we're we're level 30. Let's try it. Fuck it. Play good. Oh.